Hi, this is Michelle from Shell Colorado and I am going to show you now how to prep your spun yarn that you have on your spindle to ply it. So I have my a spindle here that's uh, got some fiber on it that I want to uh, prep for this. You will find a lot of people who like to make what's called a center pull ball from which they ply. I don't like to do that because as you can see this fiber is wanting to do some twisting back on itself which is what it's supposed to do but in a center pull ball sometimes it makes it easier for the single to tangle and that makes it harder to ply. So I like to transfer my spun singles onto a bobbin instead and there's a couple of different choices that we have for that. This is called a storage bobbin. You can get it at any um, yarn store or fiber store that sells spinning supplies and this one is about five inches long. You can see it's got a hole through there. Um, and its function is to go onto this device, which is called a Lazy Kate. So eventually what will happen is once we get the fiber onto the bobbin, um, the bobbin gets put onto the kate here like so and we ply from this. So I'm going to show you how to transfer the fiber to the bobbin and I'm also going to show you how you can make your own lazy kate. So I showed you this bobbin before but this is a perfectly acceptable bobbin to use as well. I'm sure you know what this is. You could also use a uh, paper towel roll as well and maybe just cut it in half. Um, handy thing. With this you might want to use a piece of tape to hold your end and but I'm not going to do that here. So all I am doing, I'm going to hold this right here with my hand. I'm going to make one turn just like this to help lock it in. And that's the only time I'm going to make a move like that. The reason is that this motion adds or takes away twist from your single that you so carefully put into it. You can see the motion here a little better with this big piece of roving. If I go like this, you can see I've put twist into the fiber. So we don't want to do that while we're transferring. So all I'm going to do then is I'm going to un wind the fiber that's on the spindle onto my bobbin and you can see here that I'm not taking away or adding any twist with this motion so it's really important to to do that in this way. So you'll transfer the entire amount of your single onto the bobbin. And when I have that done, we'll get ready to ply.